I love drawing because it gives me a sense of freedom and I love to create um, imaginary things and draw things in my own little world. My name is Laura Kwok and I'm an artist, illustrator and muralist. A muralist is someone who paints on large walls in the city and uh, transforms public spaces. You are allowed to paint on walls, but you do have to get the permission of the person who owns the building. Today, we're going to be drawing a character called Monsieur French Toast, and he's made up of all different kinds of breakfast foods. I think it's cool to draw him because I love food, and so sometimes I like to add the things I like into my drawings. All right, let's get started with the drawing portion. Monsieur French Toast is cool because he's made out of all different kinds of breakfast foods. Let's draw Monsieur French Toast. We're going to start with a square U shape for his face and a wide flat bit for the top of his head. He's got two beady little eyes and a bushy mustache with lots of lines. You're doing great. I'm going to add two slanted lines for friendly eyebrows and a tiny little smile. Now what goes well with French toast? Butter. We're going to draw a little square of butter on his head with wiggly lines coming off the side like it's melting. Now we're going to draw another wiggly line all around his face. This could be the butter or jam or marmalade, whatever you like best on your toast. Let's give him a classy bow tie because Monsieur French Toast is a gentleman. It's looking really, really good. Now for the body, it's going to be a smooth U shape. Monsieur French Toast's body is actually a jar of peanut butter because that's my favorite thing to have with toast. I'm going to draw a squiggly eight to make a peanut shape and then add in some crisscross lines. Now remember, you don't have to make it a peanut butter jar. That's just me. You can make it a jelly jar and draw a strawberry or blueberry instead of a peanut. For the bottom of the jar, I'm going to draw a horizontal line. Now let's give him some arms. I'm going to draw one saying hello and then the other holding a pitcher of good old maple syrup. I'm going to draw a circle and then a D shape behind it. Next, draw another bigger curve following the same line to create the pitcher handle. Now I'm going to draw a large curvy L shape for the bottom of the pitcher. The top of the pitcher is going to be a flattened oval and another little oval for the spout. Now connect the two ovals with a tiny curved smile line to finish it off. And you can add a maple leaf to make it extra Canadian. The final step is his buttery legs. They're just rounded L shapes with tiny little slivers on the right side. You can add some squiggly lines at the bottom corner for the butter that has melted into little puddles. And there's Monsieur French Toast in his glory. Now the rest is up to your imagination. You could draw a whole bunch of breakfast foods to keep Monsieur French Toast company. Add your own personality to eggs, bacon, sausages and waffles to make a whole breakfast club. Thank you so much for following along and drawing with me today. It means a lot. And I hope that you always keep drawing and always keep using your imagination wherever you go.